Hello everyone and welcome. Today I am going to be making for you apple dumplings. If you love apple pie and you are always intimidated of making an apple pie, then this is the perfect recipe for you. It is simple, quick, easy, and delicious. So let's get started. Everyone, so I have my pan on a medium heat and I'm gonna melt my butter. And I'm gonna add all of my ingredients except for the apple cider. So I'm gonna add my sugar, my spices, and heavy cream. Another wonderful and easy, delicious recipe for your upcoming Christmas holidays, seeing that we're now uh, over with the Thanksgiving holidays. And we're just gonna bring this to, let this come to a boil, and then we're gonna cut the heat off. Beautiful already, guys. So as you can see, it has come to a boil, and this is gonna make a wonderful dessert to add to your Christmas menu. So now we're gonna cut the heat off, and we're gonna let this sit to the side, you know, just to cool as we work on the apples. Everyone, so let me show you what I did so far. I have my dish over here and I sprayed it. I sprayed the inside with a bit of Baker's Joy spray. I always use the spray and you can find this on my uh, Amazon web store. If you're looking for it, that's where you can find it, FYI. So I sprayed my dish and I'm using the Crescent Pillsbury, the Pillsbury Crescent Rolls. Okay, and that's an eight pack. All right, so I peeled my apple and I cored it. And here is my dough. So I'm gonna, you know, you're gonna place your apple at the widest end. Okay, and then you're gonna I call these like uh, wings. So you're just gonna fold that over, fold this over like that. And then we're gonna roll it from the wider end to the thinner end, just like that. And I'm gonna show you how I, you know, prepped my apples as well. And you just place it in your dish just like that so we're gonna do another one i have my dough on some parchment paper you're gonna place your apple to the at the widest end and you're gonna bring these two together and you're gonna roll all the way down just like that guys place it in your dish just like so so we're going to roll out the other four and these are the crescent rolls guys okay so let me show you how i did the apples oh guys also you want to preheat your oven at 350 degrees and you're gonna bake these until they're nice and golden brown for about 35 to 40 minutes okay so I'm gonna use my little gadget here and I'm just gonna core my apple with this guys it takes a little muscles okay but that's how I do it beautiful gadget but you also need a, a bit of muscles 
Okay, so that's how I did it, guys. So now I'm gonna roll one more and let you see. And that's it, guys. So I'll bring you back when I'm all done. And so we are ready to pour our liquid, our nice thick sauce. And if it sits for a while, it's gonna harden up a little bit. So you're gonna have to like heat it up, you know, just to loosen it up, okay? But you can always prepare this you know prepare the apples first and then you you can do this last it's all up to you guys all right so we're going to pour our mixture over our apples and that's a beautiful color already so the next thing you want to do is to pour your apple cider at the ends just like that and not on top of the apples. And some people use Sprite. You can use Sprite, that is totally up to you. But you wanna pour this like on the sides. Okay, so guys, we're gonna put it into the oven until they're nice and golden brown for about uh, 35 to 40 minutes. So I'll see you back when they're all done. I just took them out of the oven and they were in there for exactly 40 minutes. Don't they look amazing guys? I think they came out really awesome. So I'm going to let them cool for a little bit before I can cut into one and let you see what it looks like. Okay, everyone, let's do this. Let's dig in. Yummy. There you go, guys. There you go. So I'm gonna put a little bit of ice cream. Oh, yes, guys. Oh, yes, guys beautiful and simple dessert beautiful and simple dessert i hope you give this recipe a try and let me know how it came out for you thanks so much for watching and i will see you in the next one bye bye Guys, I have to tell you, this is to die for. It is amazing.